We are in New Orleans, Louisiana. Welcome to the Terror Dome. I got so much trouble on my mind. Yeah, you know, Grim, I love coming to the big sleazy. Some beignets, beads, Dixieland, and a serpent and a rainbow. <laughs> it really helps me relax. Show me your tits. Yeah, save that for the mutants gone wild taping after the game, huh, Junior? Whatever. Today's matchup promises severed limbs and ruined careers. The Midway Mutants battle. The New Gorland Zombies. Welcome to MFL Game Day. Grim Blitzrow here. Let's listen in on the sidelines and hear what the team's captains have to say. <laughs> If you're just waking up wondering who put that vice on your head and filled your mouth with vacuum cleaner, dirt, and cat litter, you're not alone. After all, it's Sunday, MFL game day. Hey, you look tired, Junior. And Bricks, you look like they just used your head in field goal practice. Spent all night in the ER. We ate Chinese food last night. Food poisoning? I wish! I got the chopsticks lodged in my ears again. You know, they should have a warning on them things. Hot one, hot two, hot, hot, hot. And he'll pick up seven yards on that play. <laughs> Second and three. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot. If there were any functioning brain cells before that hit, they're gone now. He's going to have the IQ of a rutabaga after that hit. And it's first and ten. Hot one, hot two, hot, 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 hot. That's a nice gain of about seven yards on that run. Second and three. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot, hot. And nothing was going to stop him from getting into the end zone. Except maybe self-doubt, but he seems to have worked through it. <laughs> okay, nice and easy like a two-foot putt. You miss two-foot putts all the time, Grim. Goes right through. Yeah, like a double stuff burrito from Taco Hell. Here comes the kicker. Oh, I can't wait to hear this. What's the kicker, Grim? Uh, this guy in the field. Oh, I thought you were going to tell me a story like, here's the kicker. When I turned on the light, it wasn't a broad in my bed. It was a chimp wearing a wig. And it's first and ten. Second down and more than the QB would like. And he pounds the ball into the defense, picking up seven. Third down and eight. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot, hot, hot. The week the quarterback said they'd blow up the defense today. <laughs> he was right. Kapow! And the punter takes a break from knitting on the sidelines to come in and punt. His knitting is superb, Grim. That cross-stitching, unbelievable. And he's got a chance for a good return here. Oh, and he looks like he just saw 400 scary movies after that hit. Yeah, sounds like my off-season. 
and it's first and ten. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot eight. That's the way to move the chains. That's good for a first down. This game is all about momentum and killing. And it's first and ten. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot And they run it for a couple of yards. And that'll be second and eight to go. Hot, hot one. Hot. Oh, and he just left an outline on the ground like he was trying to wipe out the dinosaurs. Must be opposite day because he's the one who just got wiped out. Hot, hot one. Hot. a pick and now the quarterback is pow and how about a little dirt sandwich and it's first and ten hot hot one hot two hot when it feels like to have your teeth removed without Novocaine. If I had all my teeth knocked out like that, I'd have them made at the dice, Grim. It'd be fun to gamble with my own teeth. <laughs> they weren't even on the same page on that play. Third down and, well, good luck. Hot one, hot two, hot Another interception. Geez, you give this guy a bigger paycheck than everybody else combined. And it's oh, he just got pulverized by a mutant trap. And he bursts into the end zone for the score. What a run. You know, letting these dogs into the league is a slippery slope, Grim. First them, then vampires, then mermaids. Then before you know it, we're letting in cat girls. You know, things really start to get weird at that point. <laughs> Don't want to make any mistakes here. Just kick the ball through the upright, for God's sake. Straight through the uprights. Here comes the kickoff. Let's see if the defense can hold them. He sets up for the return. Let's see if he can break one wide open. up about six on the play. And that'll be second down and four. Third down and ten. Hot. Hot one. Hot two. Hot. 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 Let's see if they can get a return. He's got the ball now. Let's see what he does with it. Oh, what a brutal hit. And it's first and ten. Hot. Hot one. Hot. And that's how you run it, folks. Picks up eight there. Second down and two. Hot. 
Hot one, hot two, hot, hot three. Oh, man, what a throw. And Sonic Blast just cleared the field for the receiver. And he finds open spaces running toward the end zone. Turn on your jets, you son of a bitch. Now, there are some who would argue that we should just skip this step and make touchdowns worth seven. What, and kick the kicker's job in half? They'd just be called sitters then. The kick is good! Man, as expected, those are pretty much just gimmies. It's the end of the first quarter, and I just want to say that this is the ugliest thing I've ever seen. Other than my mother-in-law, of course. The teams are lined up for the kickoff. Just catch it, run it back, and don't die. And it's first and ten. Hot one, hot two, hot three. Looks like a pass just wrestles away from that tackle. Second down in a lot. Third down and the punter is warming up. No, he just heard footsteps and took his eye off the ball. What a peck ahead. Catch the ball, asshole. Don't do anything stupid here. Just punt the damn ball and play defense. And he put all of his foot into that one. The return man catches the ball and heads upfield. Oh, with the brain scrambler. And it's first and ten. Hot one, hot two, hot three. Time. Like a jack in a box, Bricks. You never know when one of those hot potatoes is gonna blow. You just crap your pants, Junior. And it's first and ten. Hot one, hot. Huey passes it for maybe a yard. They've got to open up the offense here, Bricks. Second down and nine. Hot. I personally think that the ginormous guy is compensating for... Man, he just laid the wood on him on that one and knocked the ball out. And he'll pick up the first down with a nice piece of running there. And it's first and ten. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot... Three. He zings it in there for a four-yard gain. Second down and six. Hot. Hot one. Hot two. Hot. Hot. Catch the ball. Get the first down and don't die. See, it's really a simple game when it comes down to it. First down and nine. Put on a display there. Touchdown! <laughs> well, a little chip shot here, extra point, but this guy could blow it. It's good! Looks 
see if they can keep the momentum going and keep these fans happy and uh, or bloodthirsty, whichever. And it's first and ten. Hot one. Second down and long. Hot. Hot one. Third down and long. Hot. Hot one. Great pass on that play. They caught the defense napping. And they'll line up for the punt here. He boomed that one. Let's see if they can get a return. Nice catch, and it turns on the afterburners. Punt returners in this league have a life expectancy of three. Oh, that's a vicious hit. And the crowd loves it. He just turned that guy into 300 pounds of ground mutiny. And you can't hit a guy much harder than that. And that is unfortunate. The defense better look out. The offense called the Beast Boost Dirty Trick. We're at the two-minute warning, and we'll take a quick timeout. Graham, will you tell the interns to get us some franken dogs and a couple of beers? I'm dry over here. I'll take nachos and a scotch. Uh, looks like a pee for me, too. Man, what a hit that was. They stumped the clock with their first timeout, leaving them with two in case they need them. Yeah, just like condoms, hatchets, and wives, huh, Graham? You know, you just summed up why we don't get together outside of work, Bricks. You've got to catch that. Third down and five. Just follow the bloody footprints to the new line. That's a first down. They stopped the clock, but they only have one timeout left. Uh, that's okay, Grim. They can have mine. That's, uh, that's nice, Bricks. But our timeouts are for our sponsors, and we need money more than they do. Oh, and that one's going to hurt. He may not be able to comprehend math after that hit. What's math? That's it. That's their last time out. It's them against the other team and the clock. Well, that doesn't seem fair. I'm going to throw a hammer on the field and even the odds. And into the end zone for a touchdown. Once he got his hands on that pet. Mm, I don't remember that being an officially sanctioned NFL rule. Second down, and, and they've had enough. The offense jumps on sides and attacks the ref. Second down, and we've got to pick up at least half of this. They just made up a whole lot of field in a hurry with that pass play. And I just made up a new name for a sandwich. 
And the quarterback goes into a hurry-up offense and calls all the plays from the line of scrimmage from here on out. Oh, that was a big hit. Hey, Bricks, I'll bet you took a lot of shots like that over your career. Ah, uh, let's see. About a quarter after three, Grim, but my watch is a bit slow. And that was a perfect pass, and he scores handily. <laughs> you know, this shouldn't be easy, but with kickers, you never know. It goes right through. Yeah, like a double stuffed burrito from Taco Hell. <laughs> the teams are lined up for the kickoffs. He's going to be able to run this one back. I wonder if the kicker was setting up an easy kill. The offense changes the pace by going into a hurry up. Does that mean the defense gets into a hurry up too? Fred, can I kill him? It's going to shave a few days off his life. At the end of quarter two, it's a blowout. We now go to our halftime show sponsored by Monsatan Industries, makers of great killer products like Ground Up. Use it on pesky weeds or neighbors, and they'll be gone by morning. Boy, these guys are going to need to pull off a huge comeback in the second half to win this game. Here comes the kickoff. Rip the toast! Why do we even come back and bother? This is a waste of my time! Yeah, if only one team is gonna show up, why should we have to? <laughs> the home team is feeling confident as they get the kickoff into the air. Scoring makes anyone confident. It certainly does, Bricks. It certainly does. High five! And it's first and ten. Hot. Hot one. Hot two. Hot three. And then Catch will give them a first down. And it's first and ten. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot, hot. And that's the way to get the sticks moving. He picks up five on that play. Second down and five. Second down and a lot. Offense says it's time to put the ref out of his misery. Second down and ain't gonna happen, partner. One, hot two, hot, hot. And he sticks his fingers in the defender's eyes, netting him a pickup of about eight on the play. Third down and forever. The ground game should be their bread and butter. A gain of eight right there. Hey, anyone seen that Korean kid yet with my barbecue? Last time I ordered Korean, I got Kim Jong-il. Nice 
Nice punt. Should move them back nicely. He's got the ball. Pow! With the brain scrambler. And it's first and ten. They need to make him a target more often. And it's first and ten. Pass and catch for three. The receiver needs to break some tackles. Second down and seven. to keep the drive alive. And it's first and ten. And picks up maybe a deuce at most. Uh, speaking of deuces, I got a... Uh, <clears throat> hey, you got a dollar for the bathroom attendant? He threatened me if I didn't tip him next time. And that'll be second and eight to go. Third down and the punter is warming up. for nine yards. And that'll bring up second and one. Well, it looks like he wanted to run before he caught it. You gotta keep your eye on the ball. Come on, you dirtbag. You gotta make that catch. And that'll bring up third and one. Ouch! What is this, 80s wrestling? Come on, nice and easy, right through the uprights. Well, surprise me, he made it look easy and he gets three points for it. Here comes the kickoff. Let's see if the defense can hold them. He sets up for the return. Let's see if he can break one wide open. One time when I was playing, a guy hit me so hard, I went into a dark tunnel. Thought I saw my grandparents waving at me in the light. Turns out it was just the visitor's tunnel that he knocked me into, and it was the paramedics waving fingers in my face. I Second down and more than the QB would like. Hot one, hot two, hot, hot three. And the ball razors through the defense, cutting a defender in half. But that means he can wrap up the other half. And like bricks his bowels, he is loose and heading for the end zone. He could go all the way. He's at the 30. He's at the 20. Caught for the first down. Second there. Second down and ten. Hot, hot 
One, hot two, hot three. And they pick up nine with that catch. Uh, not enough for first, but still a nice game. The third quarter mercifully ends. If this game is as painful to watch as we are to listen to, then please accept our apologies. This one is just about over. I got the thing stuck in my ear again. Hot one. Hot. And he zips that one in there for a touchdown. Man, those bones can boogie. The lack of muscle, fat, organs, and skin really makes it easy for him to dance. Don't make any mistakes here, or they'll kick the shit out of you in the locker room. Straight through the uprights. When you give up points, you need to get them back. Here comes the kickoff. Let's see if they can make a pay. First and ten. Second down in a very lot. That one's incomplete. The receiver couldn't get there. Yeah, need to get his mother. Third down and, well, good luck. And he runs it for four yards. They are going for it, and the defense is licking their mutant lips. Kaboom! And the quarterback unleashes a sonic blast against the defense, knocking everyone down but his... Man, these guys are some high rollers, and they just won the pot. That's a... Hey, you kill a ref. It's not murder if they have it common, right? Take the hand. Do something about that ref, you pussies. I won't even get how much... If they don't pick it up here, and the offense jumps off sides to kill the ref, they say, we're mad as hell and not going to take it anymore. Yeah! Oh, here comes the punting unit. You know, punters really do know how to party, Bricks. Yeah! Oh, yeah, I have pictures that, uh, that, well, maybe actually shouldn't discuss this on the air. And he snags the punt and looks for open. He refuses to. Oh, man, he just crushed him. <laughs> I got to see that again. I had a kid once like that walking down the sidewalk, texting with his earbuds in. Freaked him out. He said, hey, what'd you do that for? I said, I did you a lesson. What lesson? He said that unless you're a baboon with big baboon balls, you got to pay attention. Yeah, along the jungle, you know. 
was an explosion, but everyone's walking away from it. Them cool guys always walk away from explosions. Hey, that might be good for the movies, but it's awful for the MFL. Hot, hot one, hot two. Third down, and the punter is warming up. And this guy is making a name for himself tonight with a pickup of about 10 on that play. Hey, he makes up a name for himself every night. That's how he stays ahead of the bounty hunters. He's wanted in 50 spots. I can't believe the defense didn't stop the run. Or maybe they just secretly wanted four more shots at the QB. That's probably more like it. And it's first and 10. Hot one, hot two. And that was a bone crusher right there, folks. Second down and a lot. Hot one. Hot. Third down and, well, good luck. Six-yard game there. That's a solid pickup. I wish people would do solid pickups more often. I step in dog turns on my front porch every day. Man, these guys have metal balls. They're going to try to pick up the first down here. Do they jingle when they run? They clank, you moron. He said balls, not bells. You know, a lot of guys talk about stepping up their game, Bricks. He just stepped up and blew up. <laughs> He's got a lot of guts, doesn't he? And you can see the grounds crew cleaning him up now. Hot potato gets him every time. When in a hurry-up offense, the offense needs to run out of bounds or take a timeout to stop the clock. First down! Give this guy a few catches and watch his confidence take off. He is deadly in the open field, Bricks. Hot. Hot one. Hot. And he just nailed him right on the numbers for a touchdown! And this guy has quite the female following. Listen to them. Yeah, they all want to jump his bones! I wish the middle linebacker would have jumped his bones. I just lost a saw buck on that play. And they line up for the extra point. It's good. They need a good return here to set up the offense. Looks like he'll be able to run this one back if he's not terrified for his life. He is, but he's got no choice. Two minutes left in the game, and we'll be right back after I top off my drink. Grab me a scotch while you're up. And it's first and ten. Whenever a player gets big like fumble, you've got to protect the ball better than that. The 20. Here comes the defense. Someone better buy this guy dinner tonight because he just saved a touchdown with that tackle. The offense wants to speed things up, so it signals a hurry up. Yeah, see, this Brits' his ex-girlfriend signaled when... Oh, no, it's the sticky ball dirty trick. The defense pretty much turned the ball into a yo-yo of doom. That, my friends, was an all-pro NFL hit. <laughs> Second down. First time out under two minutes. The chess game has begun. It's like chess only. You can kill people. And the hurry-up offense wears out the defense since they can't rest their players. Oh, great throw! Great catch! And then put six points on the board! The defense can do anything to stop a throw that good, man! You mean aside from bribing the ref, killing the quarterback, or actually playing some D? Don't try to get fancy here. Just put the ball down and kick it. In that order, Grim? It goes right through. Yeah, like a double stuffed burrito from Taco Hell. The kicker's going to have to kick the ball just right so his team can recover it.
perfect kick and recovery by the kicking team. And the offense goes into a hurry up to pick up the pace of the game. Hot two. Second down, and the offense quickly calls their second timeout. That's how you do it. Do what? And the quarterback signals for a hurry up offense. Hey, Grant, what's the hurry up offense? There's no huddle. The offense calls plays at the line of scrimmage and plays really fast. Why would they do that? Touchdown! They're going for two points. And he gets into the end zone for the conversion. Looks like they're lined up for an onside kick. Uh, I thought they were going to do some sort of chorus line. And it's first and ten. Remember, folks, in the NFL, you are allowed to touch the quarterback, just like that. <laughs> the defense takes its final timeout. They can't stop the clock anymore, so they'll need to stop the offense. Second down and more than the QB would like. What is this, 80s wrestling? Third down and eight. The Zombies were all brains today and win at home. They come up big today with a solid win and the opposition will be licking their wounds on the long plane ride home. I heard wounds taste just like chicken. How was it Scrambles tomato soup? I forget, but a good scab tastes like bacon. Damn, I know. Mm-mm, a scab lettuce tomato sandwich. Sounds like a picnic. And the MVP is about to inspire us with some words of wisdom. I'm a hot scab Blitzrow with Brickhead Mulligan and Bricks Jr. and all the folks at Evil SN want to thank you for watching this presentation of the Mutant Football League. Today's game was brought to you by the Hexon Oil Corporation. We drill it, spill it, and kill it 